Hi, it's Jackie Ozen here. Today's Toronto Tuesday is at a really special place close to my own home. We're right now sitting at White's Road and Stroud's in the Metro Plaza that everybody knows at a really cool place called Crocodoodle. If you've got kids at home who've been cooped up for about nine months like I do, and you're young at heart yourself, this is a really cool place to visit. I have the pleasure of being with Vanessa and Marianne today, two sisters who are adorable, who own this place and run it. And we'd love to tell you about it. We'd love for you to visit. There's some really cool stuff here we're gonna share. So if you don't mind, we're gonna get right into it. Um, I'm like a kid in a candy store here. There's so many cool things here to look at, to uh, enjoy, observe. Um, what's, what do people need to know about you? First of all, you're open. Yes, yes. We're, open. we're open, we're open for business. Yeah. And you just celebrated a one year anniversary, which yeah. is great. So yeah, we took over the studio in October of last year. So yeah, yeah, we just celebrated one year anniversary. Um, yeah, we are open. Um, we're open for drop in painting, but now it's a little bit different. We just take reservations um, okay. for uh, in studio painting. And we have also got a lot of items that you can uh, do a paint at home sort of activity. Mm -hmm. yeah. So that's what I want to talk about because I know most of us as parents, it's so hard to keep the kids entertained and, you know, engaged. And I know in my house, there's a whole lot of, you know, yeah. telling kids what to do and clean up no and the kids are getting, honest, yeah, right? yeah, try to restrict, but then there isn't enough time right now. And it's so important to get their creative juices flowing and actually spend quality time with your children. So mm -hmm. if you're watching this and you're looking for something meaningful to do and fun with your kids, um, take it easy, have a, have mm -hmm. a deep breath before you start if you're the OCD type and if you're perfectionist <laughs> like I am. But it's a great opportunity and every year when our family goes on vacation, we used to go to a crocodoodle and make really nice stuff and we'd put the date on it. Mm -hmm. So coming into the holidays, like how easy is it? And how creative do you need to be to come in and pull something off like this adorable? You really, really don't, don't need, need to, to be. be oh my God, we look yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm telling you. <laughs> we sisters. really don't need to be, like anyone, it's all ages, right? Like you young, old, you don't have to have like creative juices and you like you yeah. can, there's really, look, we always like to say that there's no right or wrong way to paint. Okay. So yeah. literally anything goes. Yeah, but everyone, like you can also kind of pre, if you are the OCD type, you can mm -hmm. also look ahead of time on mm -hmm. like Pinterest or any, mm -hmm. if you Amazing. Google yes. any like cookies for Santa plate, yeah. there is going to be like or millions of ideas. Or something yeah. at like winners or something like that and you take a photo. Yeah, yeah, take yeah. a photo. But you want to make it your own. Yeah, you so. personalize it, right? So yeah. it can be a cookies for Santa for the Oven family. Oh, and you sketch it. You basically get a pencil, you mm -hmm. come in, you buy the plate yeah. or the platter or right. the this yeah. can I just grit that amazing this adorable ornament actually the little not the ornament he's a <laughs> just a party animal. he's a party yeah. animal yeah. he's so cute he's a little <laughs> reindeer and they look really complicated but I'm telling you from experience it, it they're not overly complicated no. um, a perfect size for for young children and so uh, mm. could someone as young as four or five paint something like this or is this yeah. a grown-up who's done no, this? for sure we have um we have actually in studio we have high chairs available so mm -hmm. as young as we've had people i mean like even like a few months old that then they would be doing like a baby print or like a hand print kind of piece oh um, that's so party i know these are actually really popular for ages like even two two plus mm -hmm. um anything he's goes, so really, cute right? yeah just to sit on like your credenza or in your kitchen yeah. or on a night table for a little one so you you'll basically sketch it out with pencil yeah, and you could erase or you can, or you can with the paint. Yeah, yeah. I don't recommend that <laughs> if, if you're watching this I think you should come in and pencil this out or from the comfort of your own home and then take a look at it and probably have these two lovely ladies look at it and tell you if it looks good uh, before you paint it right yeah, that also works as well yeah. <laughs> and how long does it take to do something like this like you know smaller things like this little animal mm -hmm. or this plate is it so hours or usually um, we have people come in there I think a good time like it's about an hour minutes. an hour and yeah, a half or so half. okay um, yep and then so these are actually the fired pieces but if you like like when you're painting it, like there's like it's a little bit. Can we grab? Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, oh, there he is. Yeah. Really big difference. So as you're painting something that's been painted and not glazed and fired versus something that has been, it looks very different. Yeah. Yeah. They become more animated when they're yeah. when they're yeah. glazed. The yeah. and, and then and more vibrant. Yeah. yeah, and also for the plates or any mugs, like any of these, um, when they're out of the kiln, they're actually food safe. So they're food safe. Yeah, okay. it's a brilliant shiny so finish. You could do cookies for, for yeah. Santa. For Santa. <laughs> or cookies you for yourself. The plate. There are a lot of cool effects on a lot of these little speckles, little <laughs> dots. Yeah, these are our fleckle paints, and then these are our regular colors. 
Um, but you can mix and match between the two and create whatever yeah. masterpiece you like. Yeah. Awesome. Can we show them this beautiful bowl mm -hmm. with a wonderful message, especially these mm -hmm. days? Yeah. Be the reason someone smiles today. So this is a great gift for grandma and grandpa or an aunt and uncle or a neighbor, a little chip bowl right. or a, you know, a vegetable platter or something wonderful. Mm -hmm. Is there a date on that one in the back? No, that one doesn't have a date. No, day. let's mm -hmm. date these so we can remember. <laughs> um, cool Tonka truck for little boys or girls who love trucks. It's actually a piggy bank. And there it sits. That's basically the clay piece that they're going to be working with through the pottery. Mm -hmm. the and there's the coin there. slot. That is so cute. Mm -hmm. That is so cute. And the stopper goes on at the bottom to make yeah. sure that it's an actual. Yeah. Amazing. And so between my painting, let's say I came in today and I painted for 90 minutes, mm -hmm. when can I expect to have my masterpiece back? Yeah. We, ho we hope it's a masterpiece. <laughs> <laughs> it will be. It, it will be. be. Yeah. Um, it takes about a week. Yeah, a week or so Amazing. to turn around to, to glaze everything. We let the glaze dry and then it goes into the kiln. Um, we aim to fire about once a week. Okay. Because um, the kiln is, is, is pretty big um, and it fits quite a lot of pieces. So we fire about once a week and then takes about like 24 to 48 hours for the entire firing process because it does get really, really hot. Yeah. Um, and then the cooling and everything. And then, yeah, and then we reach out to you again once they're ready for pickup. So about a week turnaround, I'd say. So know that coming in that you're not gonna walk in and walk out with your piece, yeah. but it is a nice surprise because yeah. we can see from that turtle once this is thrown yeah. into the kiln, it's going to be a really vibrant yeah. and We always encourage people piece. to take before uh, before pictures mm -hmm. so that they can compare it with like when they pick it up. It's, it's like after. such a big mm -hmm. difference usually. The colors will turn out a lot brighter. And Amazing. Yeah, they, it's like doing like, it's like getting a treat like twice, right? When you come in to paint and then when you pick up, it's like, oh. It is. It's yeah. always a nice surprise to yeah. come in. A really cool alternative if you don't feel ready or comfortable yet to be in a store setting is these really, really cute take-home kits. Mm -hmm. yeah, so, so can we show people what these are and yeah, talk sure. about them? So here we have sort of like ready uh, packed uh, holiday take-home kits. Um, these are our, so our choice for like a party animal. Um, so here we have a gingerbread man party animal, and here we have a cute ranger. That's the same as the one that is this over here, actually. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so these kits are pre-packed with um, three paint pads, paint brushes, as well as instructions on how to paint it once you take home. And then after, you can feel free to give these to other people. There's um, like a gift tag here. Um, once they're done painting, um, there's instructions for them to bring it back to the studio, and we'll kill and fire it to a uh, free finish. Yeah. Yeah. But and it doesn't just have to be these items that, yeah. are, that can be gifts. Okay. So literally anything, anything. can be turned yeah. into a mm -hmm. gift. You Amazing. Totally get like a platter like this, and then it's just an additional five dollars um, for the kit fee. So to get all the painting and all the okay. brushes and all the supplies, um, additional five dollars, and then you could paint it at home and or gift it to someone or do any yeah you know, cool. anything can be made into a take home get as a gift yeah. for yourself. Yeah, yeah. like yeah. a grown up loop bag or yeah, a child loop yeah, bag. Totally okay. To you, whatever you want. So we actually um, our online store actually now has a lot of the items that we have in studio. So our online store looks a bit different. It's our brand new online store. So Amazing. a lot of the items, you can actually see per item description, the sizes and everything mm -hmm. for each item. Um, that way you can kind of either plan ahead of time, you can actually just purchase it online, have that sort of um, uh, the order go through, and then we will actually pack it up on our end, and mm -hmm. we'll let you know when it's ready for pickup. So that's an easy Okay, that's amazing. For someone who so you're not shipping the stuff, because I'm sure oh, it's really we're fragile. Offer, we're offering delivery. a local delivery you are. option. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's amazing. So like a weekly delivery option, um, just in time for Christmas as well. Mm -hmm. um, but a lot of the people, they just, you know, if they're... Uh, Close back. back. Yeah. Okay. They'll make the order online and they'll just come in and pick up everything. That's what. Um, that Amazing. way, there's no like waiting around for mm -hmm. us to pack it or like, choose some colors. Yeah. And if they're here in the Metro Plaza, yeah. <laughs> you know, just go for some shopping and come yeah. back, and things will be ready. Now, different paints. If I wanted more than three in my little loot bag, can can I buy some more in the store? And can you package them for me to take them home? Yeah. yeah? Okay. Because yeah. this guy has like the cutest little red lips. <laughs> yeah. He's so cute and the bluest eyes. Um, what else can we talk about here that's really super cool? You're working on an incredibly important initiative that I yeah. want people to hear about. So tell me. Talk about yeah, that? tell me yeah. about it, Vanessa. Okay, yeah, tell so them. These are the Smile Tile kits that we have going on right now. We've partnered up with um, Canadian Mental Health Association, the Durham uh, region, um, and we've partnered up with them to kind of do these gratitude, positivity, good vibes kind of tiles um, in which there are $10 plus tax, but $2 from each kit will be donated back to um, raising mental health awareness 
um, at the end of the year. Fantastic. So if you want to participate in that, that would be like a really, really a nice wonderful, way cool to, local yeah. initiative. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. like a paint kit, this also includes all the paint, mm -hmm. um, the paintbrushes, and yeah. also so same thing. three yeah. colors. Yeah, instructional and instructions. Because if you don't know what you're doing, <laughs> you know it's really easy to to yeah. follow the system. Just on the back, your step by step instructions. Super cool. Well. Should I mix my paint at home in my cupboard with what's going on in the kits? Mm, like Healthy mm, tip. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. So tell me, because okay. some of us might be like, oh, I've got some paint sitting around the house that I've had for three years, five years, ten years. Yeah. Not okay. recommended. No. Because so our our paints are actually are um, they've got they're water based. They have okay. actually a, a little bit of glaze in them, so they're specially made for firing in the kiln. Super um, important. Yeah. So you can't just buy <laughs> so any random like thing. Acrylic, no acrylic. Yeah, or acrylic. No yeah, acrylic. Like the biggest nightmare. Is no. it? They'll Does it fire? And sh like the the piece will kind of like get all shardy. Oh. Oh, no, and the kind of explode and do something. Not scary. safe for little people's hands or anybody's hands. No. Okay, so <laughs> stick with the products yeah. that are available here, um, and pretty much paintbrushes. Everything comes in there. If they want to buy little supplies and such, I'm sure that they can do that here yeah, yeah. or online. But look at how really all of these are super beautiful things, mm -hmm. festive things for everyone in the family, whether you're young or young at heart, like we said. Yeah. I think this is definitely going to be on my to-do list. And I think we saw the wine glass. There are some beautiful wine glasses and wine coolers that for the older crowd, the more mature crowd, the crowd that likes to drink crowd, <laughs> um, you can customize your own wine glass and your cooler and they're beautiful. So last day to order to make sure you have stuff by Christmas. Is there like a drop dead date, must um, have it in? So our last, um, so on Christmas, Eve, so November, uh, sorry, December 24th, it will be open half a day, but that's only to pick up the item. So I would say a week before that, mm -hmm. I would say maybe December, December what, like 18th, I want to say yeah. is one of the last yeah. one. Yeah, December 18th, because then that'll give us a week to glaze and fire and pack everything. Okay. And we'll still get it right before Christmas. Yeah. yeah. And I'm going <laughs> to say to people, like, try to get it the but first week wait. of December, yeah, right? Don't, don't wait, wait don't because wait. we do that to ourselves every year, yeah. whether we're gift giving, whether we're wrapping, whatever we're doing, try to get things in by the first yeah. week of December so you give your time, yeah. uh, give yourself some time to wrap it up in a really yeah. nice decoration. You also do gift cards. We yes. do. So yeah. important. My best friend got me a gift card here, which I'm ashamed to say I haven't used. <laughs> Life's been busy, no excuse, but I really wanted to have quality time with my children last year for my birthday. And so I'm going to make sure to put that to good use because this is a really great opportunity. If you don't know what to get someone and you know they're yearning for time with their family or their children, you can come in and you can book the, you know, the studio for 90 minutes and enjoy your family, your little bubble. You can all come in and just enjoy. You know, once the weather changes, it's beautiful today, but once the weather changes, people are going to be yearning for things to do inside. Yeah. And yeah. I say, why not do something fun and creative um, with your little ones? Mm -hmm. I have to... I have to take a deep breath when I do that because I'm always inclined to fix things. Um, one last thing about corrections. So I asked the girls when I first came in here and I said, if I make something and it's not so pretty, can you pretty it up? And so the question is, if you make a mistake while you're painting, mm -hmm. it just washes off, right? Yep, because our paints are all water-based, they will come off with a wet towel or a damp sponge if you do make a mistake before, before it goes in the kiln. So pre-firing, you can still kind of fiddle around and correct your mistakes and finesse it a little bit. Um, after it does come out of the kiln, it's a little bit more um, yeah, difficult. Like if you, uh, so for example, someone did like a family plaque and then I think they wrote names on each of the, like they wrote names on sort of each piece letter? and then they missed one person's oh, no. name. So then oh, after we no. fired, she was like, oh my God, I can't gift it. So like we were able to add in the name and then, and then we actually refired. Yeah. Fantastic. So the yeah. idea is not to use it if there's been a little yeah. mistake, you don't right. want to put oil on it, yeah. any food on it, you want to be able to bring it but back. as you're painting, definitely it just wipes off with water. Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. And our very practical videographer, Ryan asked, mm -hmm. are they dishwasher safe? That's okay. what a man with four kids wants to <laughs> no. know. So although we, we we actually recommend that you hand wash the pieces, okay, um, just, just because it's handmade, it's like your pieces of art. Yeah. They're one of a kind. Right? Um, yes, and they're like heirlooms, so yeah. I would not recommend putting them in the dishwasher. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Although I am guilty of having. Have you done it before? Done it? Yeah, we have. We, okay. we definitely have like mugs. We we have. We've done but, it. Um, you know, don't. <laughs> don't, don't, don't. Try not don't. To. They're pretty, like they're pretty durable, but you just because it's your own work of art, you wanted to take. Amazing. Give them your Instagram handle so that they can find you on Instagram yeah. and uh, phone number. Yeah, 
our Instagram is uh, at Crocodoodle in Pickering. Um, we also have a TikTok account, mm -hmm. um, also at Crocodoodle in Pickering. That's amazing. Um, our phone number is 905-492-4822. And we'll post it all below. We'll be sure to tag you in the post so people can find you. But if you're looking for something to do in your in Durham region, come and check this place out at White's and Strauss. Thank you for your time, ladies. Thank, Thank you. you for your patience. And um, no, no pottery has been harmed by me today, I'm happy to say. But come and check this place out because it's lovely and these girls are lovely yeah. and it makes for beautiful stuff to gift give this summer this gosh did I say summer this <laughs> winter and uh, wonderful stocking stuffers here for again the young and the young at heart mm -hmm. so come and check it out crocodoodle and pickering thanks so much ladies thank you thank so you. much